Marijuana is now legal in Minnesota, but today police made a pot bust in Faribault, illustrating the confusion surrounding sales. Sammy Salina reports. To kick off the legalization date. We were outside for maybe 45 minutes tops. Josh Swanson, an employee of Total Tobacco, helped host New Canna's sale of cannabis plants in Faribault. Customers were picking them up. First day, seasoned plants. And the police showed up. Yep, look at these fine gentlemen stealing these plants. Obviously, despite legalization, um, sales are not legalized unless it's conducted in a certain way. Uh, so the officers seized those plants. John Sherwin, Faribault Police Chief, says they believe it was marijuana plants for sale. We have to be very cautious of how we move forward. New Canna managing uh, partner Matt rapidly. Little insists they were hemp plants because of the low THC value at the time. They, they look like a cannabis plant, they smell like a cannabis plant. It really comes down to at what stage are they at? meaning is there THC in this plant right now? And the answer is no. Little says plants they sold were labeled as having the potential to go above hemp level thresholds, but they were well below them yesterday. According to a statement from the Office of Cannabis Management, sales of hemp and cannabis are treated differently under the law. They go on to say they will be responsible for regulating the legal adult use cannabis market in Minnesota. Until then, no retail sales are legal unless conducted by tribes on tribal land until businesses are licensed by the Office of Cannabis Management. Well, it is a very confusing uh, question. Jason uh, Tarasik is an attorney with Vicente LLP, a national cannabis law firm. He says he can see why growers could classify products as hemp. I think the problem is that um, the Minnesota regulators may disagree with that conclusion. They're there, to my knowledge, uh, taking the position that anything that is going to grow into marijuana uh, is is marijuana. Police say this is an ongoing criminal investigation. According to the Rice County Attorney's Office, no one has yet to be charged. Sammy Solina, Care 11 News. The new law legalizing marijuana does allow cities to pass moratoriums that may prohibit cannabis businesses until 2025. Right now, there are at least seven cities across the state that put a pause on pot to give them time to figure out regulations.